Knitting 101, Crochet 101, Basics Explained, Gauge. Gauge, what is it and why does that matter? Gauge is the number of stitches in rows per inch or centimeter in your work. It determines how big the finished product will be. Stitch gauge, arguably the more important measurement of the two. It determines the width or circumference of your piece. Making a sweater, stitch gauge determines how big around the sweater will be and whether it will actually fit your body. Row gauge. Row gauge determines the length or height of your piece. Still making that sweater? Row gauge determines how long the sweater will be and whether it will accidentally or purposely be a crop or a tunic. Measuring gauge. How do you measure? With the swatch, sometimes an S word in the yarning world. A swatch is a square at least four inches or 10 centimeters by four inches or 10 centimeters using the stitches in the pattern to determine how many stitches and rows you end up with when you use the recommended yarn weight and needle or hook size. Count how many stitches and rows there are in the four inch 10 centimeter square. Adjusting gauge. If you have too many stitches or rows, go up a needle or hook size. This will make your stitches bigger and you will have fewer stitches per inch or centimeter. If you have too few stitches, go down a needle or hook size. This will make your stitches smaller and you will have more stitches per inch or centimeter. What if I can't make gauge exactly? Everyone creates with different tension, and sometimes you may not be able to match the designer's gauge perfectly. When you've tried various needle or hook sizes and can't get both stitch and row gauge, pick stitch gauge and match that, especially in shaped garments where the final circumference is important. Sweater, sock, hat, cowl, mittens, and the like. The number of rows can be adjusted on the fly if needed. Caveat. Sometimes shaped garments have increase or decrease structures that depend on the correct number of rows. Math will get you to where you need to be when you need to adjust row counts based on your swatch and the gauge offered by the designer, but that is a different conversation for a different day. Questions? Leave a comment. Tired of garments not fitting you? I'm doing yarn wear fit research alongside Yarn Andy. We independently began the same thing and will collaborate at analysis time. Fill out one or both. Different measurements are sought by each designer. Filling out both will give us more robust data. Tag someone or share this post to spread the word. The more data we gather, the better the outcome. The link to my research form is on my homepage at carriejellic.com. Yarn Andy's research form is on her homepage at yarnandy.com. Scroll to near the bottom to find links.